So why hall monitors? Well, basically the halls of Shelton have become increasingly dangerous and that needs to change. Besides the running in the hallways and all those blonde girls clogging up traffic, it's become a center for terrified students and malicious bullying. Now, I'm not going to name any names because this is not just one student in particular. Yeah, really, it's totally just Gabe Coleman. He's the whole reason we have hall monitors. And no, despite all the rumors, it is not just one student. There was so much to protect us in these sacred hallways. <laughs> but anyway, so I don't really know about these hall monitors. They're quite a nuisance, really. We'll just keep going and see how good they can do. Tell me about the hall monitors. Well, there are four of us, and we're each super cool. Um, our uniform is the best, and you don't just get things like this. You have to earn them. Here's me, Allie. The new kid on the vlog. There's Philip the Cage Crusader, Houston the Punisher, and Ryan the Enthusiastic One. Well, we're the defenders of the hallways. We live by the best, and we prosecute according to the rules of the halls. Our top eight are chewing gum, any dress code violations, the use of cell phones or electronic items, uh, PDA, personal displays of affection, running or power walking in the hallways, any violence, high schoolers using the middle school or bathrooms, and any excessive amounts of fun. Oh my gosh, the hall monitors are such a joke. They are such the biggest nerds ever. Well, we're kind of like the Rebel Alliance of the Star Wars saga, trying to defend the good people against the evil forces of the Sith. I hate them. So why did you join the hall monitors? Well, it all started with this conversation I had with Dr. Pierce. I'm the president of the DC Comic Club. It's my only extra school curriculum. Dr. Pierce said that colleges want to see more than just that. So I decided to join the hall monitors. I never realized how incredible it would be. I get to affect the world just like my idol. You may know him as Bruce Wayne. I'm going to be graduating soon. The teacher suggested I stick around another year. That's probably because of the impact that I have on those around me. But I don't think staying would be right. Yes, I'll have a legacy, but my actual time here needs to come to an end. What do I live by this year? Well, it's my senior year, the victory lap. So either you die a hero, or you live long enough to see yourself become the villain. Why do I do this? At first, I was trying to bring the man down. But now that I am the man, it's great to have the respect. Well, it's not just the respect I get as a hall monitor, but the power that comes with the duty. Yes, I'm currently on probation. Just got off hall monitor suspension. I thought that I would try to enforce the rules a little more firmly. And they tried to bring me down. Maybe, at first, I took it a little too strong. Cell phone! Oh boy, this... Excuse me, I was just taking my trunk monkey for a walk, and I saw you shooting him for a, a cell phone violation. Please. Don't make it so loud next time. Have a nice day. I'm not sure about the second time. Dress code violation. I don't know, that seems a little excessive. A third time was for sure fine. It's true go. What are you doing? <laughs> Whatever. I got rid of all my weapons. The reason I'm a hall monitor? Because I want to be on the force when I'm older, and this would be great for breaking in my iron fist. never met my dad, but I can imagine he works for the CIA. So I want to follow in his imaginary footsteps. You know, 
teach criminals a lesson and all. So get ready, future criminals. I'm coming for you. Well, the hall monitors have been disbanded. Making this documentary has been one of the worst experiences of my life. Houston has been expelled. I'm pretty sure Philip is in a mental institution. Uh, Ryan has no friends, and Allie has no friends. Actually, none of them have any friends. Yay for hallway safety. So you tell me how well this worked out.